I am number one, not number two If I'm not the one, I'm uncomfortable See the competition I've been running through Leveled up, I only see him in my rear view Switch! Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' I'm winning, get buckets from the court side to the nosebleeds Yeah, they love it I'm winning, get buckets from the first in and the last out, see me coming. First take, I'm hotter than hot, hotter than some boiling water, I bubble the pot. Team full of ballers, baby, we winning a lot. I'm like Curry with the rock when I get to my spot. I'm tapping in, I'm passionate, this is what passion is. This here, nah, this is no accident. From the start to the finish, I'm cashing in. I am number one, not number two If I'm not the one, I'm uncomfortable See the competition I've been running through Leveled up, I only see him in my rear view Switch. Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' Welcome to Notre Dame Stadium where they will shake down thunder from the sky to cheer on their fighting Irish and hoping that plenty of echoes will reverberate in victory at the end of the game. This matchup today, part of the lifeblood of the sport, a rivalry game where the results will be remembered for a lifetime. As we'll see a squad from the Big Ten, the Michigan State Spartans, taking on the ninth-ranked team in the land, the Notre Dame Fighting Irish. Glad to have you with us for EA Sports College Football. I'm Reese Davis, David Pollock, and Jesse Paul. And he's going to bring it out of the end zone. Nice job by the kickoff team. Everybody stayed in their lanes, and they'll stop him at the 16. So the Michigan State Spartans offense is on the field for the first time today. There's just something different about rivalry games, Jesse. It's because, Reese, I think players are aware that games like this define your legacy as a player. Here comes the noise, backing this defense on third down. Quick pass to the left, trying to get it to the marker. And he gets it. Oh, it's a reverse. Pass the sticks in, still on his feet. Still in a great position. Ready, ready to stay ahead of the chains. Tackle is made at, at Michigan State. You're going to find what? A bell cow running back that you can feed. He's looking to throw it. Grabbed in the middle. It's Parachek. And he, no sign of the punt team as they will go for it and try to move those chains. On fourth down, they'll throw for it. They're trying to get to it. And he is! Intercepts it. Bring in the heat. And runs through another guy. Touchdown by the Irish. A great return for the touchdown. Any return for a touchdown is a great one to a defense. Dude, you're just thinking, hold him to three, make him kick a field goal, don't let him score points. Heck no. You turn it into offense. What a play. Catches the ball in the end zone. Take a knee. Take a knee. No, sir. I'm taking this thing all the way back 100 yards to the house. What a play. Touchdowns off the board, and they might have just done that with a sack right there. Comes the field goal unit as they'll try to take the three. 
He needs to make sure those mechanics are pure from the right hash and 40 yards away. Right down the boulevard, it's good. guys play if they make plays then they've got a shot to win this one no doubt they got to show up Th these are the team leaders these guys have open runway ahead he's at the 40 past the 20 slippery slide find his way and ran away from the crowd into the end zone touchdown Irish man oh man when you've got a weapon like that you've got to find him you got to give him the ball in space. You have some plays on your play sheet, and some of them just say, that guy, get him the ball, let him do the rest. Dangerous weapon out of the backfield. Looking to throw on second down. Unloads to the wideout. It's caught down. On third and long, he has to throw for it. Trying to burn this defensive back. Makes the grab, gets the foot down. Just precision execution on that big play. Zone here on second down. Trying to get the corner. And he's sprinting. He'll take it all away. Touchdown, Notre Dame. They are seizing control and taking away hope as they push out the lead in this PK showdown. Precision blocking up front created the open lane, and the running back followed it beautifully. Yeah, um, it's pretty easy to follow an offensive line that makes those holes and just gives you a caravan all the way to the end zone. What an unbelievable job blocking up front. Keep it on the ground again here on third down. They'll try to get the first through the air. Just a short pass to the tight end. They tend to turn into bigger runs. On third and long, he's going to have to throw for it. Pulls it in. They need one yard on third down to keep this one going. This will be the eighth play of the drive. Finds a tight end. They love to convert this third and short. They're bringing heat. Trying to escape and get it a field goal kicker. This is not a straight-on kick, a 42-yarder from the right hash. It's good. He hit that one right down the middle. Let's go to the studio now and check in with Kevin Connors. Kevin, what do you got? All right, guys, a little update on what else is happening in college football this weekend. UTEP is in front. They've owned the line of scrimmage today, but they still have some work to do to put this in the win column. They're up by seven over Oregon State. They'll throw it on first down. Oh, he's going to take a shot at the DB. Arnie Toaster coverage got it deep downfield. Touchdown, Fighting Irish. And once he got loose, it was all over. When you can run like that, the quarterback is going to give you opportunities. And look at him run by the defenders. QB sees it, stick the hand up in the air, catch the football, get to the end zone. This offense tries to find a way to draw a little closer. He's going to pass. Getting some heat. Under heat, he gets rid of it. The pass falls incomplete, and that's how we'll finish this half. We've played two quarters here. Time to go to Kevin Connors in our halftime update. Fellas, what an environment there today. All the animosity and flat-out hatred that comes with a good old-fashioned rivalry game on display in that first half. It's been a fun start to this one, and this offense has really been the story. They've opened up a sizable lead, and unless something drastic changes, things might get even more out of hand. A combination of lethal efficiency, and that offensive line has been the key. They've mauled that defense and also just about broken their will. With that, let's throw it back to the guys to see how this rivalry matchup plays out. Nine. 
He's looking to throw. Fires to the tight end. Across the 25, he's got room. And the give to the back. He'll get that one off. Tough today, because you're going up against one of the top 25 defenses stopping the run. Throws into double coverage, and it's picked off. The 50. Inside the 30. He's at the 10. on the football, makes the interception. Everybody on defense, we turn to offense, go lay some blocks so my guy can get it and take it back to the house. They'll run play action. Trying to get to it. And he'll be knocked down at the two-yard line. Well, we've seen this offense struggle early in this game, protecting the quarterback. They went in at halftime, thought they'd made the right adjustments, but it's not looking like it right now. They're still having issues keeping this guy standing up straight up front. They're just getting beat across the board. Pre-snap motion quarterback trying to get a read. The pitch. Powers through the defender. Powers through. Running toward the tape. And a big play there on the option. The pitch was executed perfectly. And right there you see the key to this football team's success. Not just offensively. They rip off explosive plays. That's why they've been winning games here as of late. They can get chunks at a time. They've got playmakers all over the field. If you can just give him a little crease, he can take it the distance, but they couldn't. Throw to the end zone, it's picked off. And he's wrapped up after a solid return on the pick. And I tell you what, when defenses play zone, all eyes are on the quarterback. You have a zone to drop to, but you're setting on the quarterback, reading his eyes. Great job by the defense, understanding the ball was coming out, breaks on the football, goes in. Hunter got some work last time. They'd like to keep him on the sidelines in this drive. Yeah, and it's not something you want to say very often. You don't want the punter out there. This offense needs to get back lathered up and get a little bit more. Oh, look out! There he goes! They have never been able to get into a rhythm throwing the football. Timing's been off. Accuracy hasn't been great. We've seen some drops. Just not insane. Jesse, you know what? Even if a defense knows that about the opposing quarterback, there's something demoralized. And he'll run it into the end zone. Touchdown, Spartans. Yeah, nice pitch, nice catch. And listen, maybe this helps next game, right? Like, we're trying to find a rhythm, find something that works, find somebody to go to. And this offense is struggling. You're down by 1,000. But I like that they continue to fight. It's still huge. It's 35 down big, but they'll keep fighting to the bitter end and line up for the onside kick here. He's able to grab the football, and the hands team gets the job. Going up top on first down. Makes the grab, and it is a chunk play. Looking to move it through the air. They get to him as he throws. Touchdown, Notre Dame! And the pummeling has started. Extended this lead, guys, starting to put the hammer, but sometimes a rivalry game can give you a little of extra fight back. And there can be no panic at this point now. You've worked too hard this offseason, David. They've had this game circle. Moving the running back, trying to get the D to tip its hand. Now the toss. Bulldozes his way through. 
to give as they work on that clock. Looks as if he's going to run it. Touchdown! points and more points this offense has had their way they just keep their foot on the gas keep putting up points keep putting up touchdowns and you know what it's the defense's job to stop you it's reverse pass the sticks and he may get more oh what a move to get room hits the accelerator to the right and we have breaking news they score yet another touchdown this is the debate of where you fall. It's your job to stop me or I should get concerned. Because this offense obviously has had themselves a day. And apparently, their day's not over. They're going to continue to keep scoring. And the defense better do something about it. the toughest call on the play sheet third and long balls at the 25 and he throws another interception his third one of the night and they'll close in on him after a good return on the interception the number one objective for a defense is to make the offense one dimension well when they're trailing by this much late in the game they're one dimension they have to pass the football we can bring more speed on the field you see it we know you're throwing the football nice break on the football nice interception this one's almost over looks like the offense will just take a knee there is a long and storied history of great games between these two rivals and this chapter adds another to that legacy Really Im impressed by the poise by the winning team as well here. They weren't overhyped in this game. They came out, they looked prepared, they were calm, definitely confident. And David, they were able to go out and execute well enough to get this win. And it's hard in these rivalry games with all the emotions running so deep. Like you sometimes get overzealous, sometimes you get too many penalties. It's hard to rein in your emotions, but they did. They kept it in check and now bragging rights for a whole year. So that's going to do it for us. For Jesse Palmer, David Pollock, I'm Reese Davis saying so long. This has been another presentation of EA Sports College Football.